Harrison, hello. Hello. I'm going to ask you some questions today about your course right. and what you're doing on it. Yeah, that's okay. fine. Um, so tell me a little bit about, um, so what course do you study for us? Study BTEC Music, Level 3 Diploma. Amazing. And yeah. uh, what is the uh, unit that you're currently looking at? Um, events, like management, and yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs> right, lovely. Um, and so on the course, what are the things that you're gearing up? I know that you've done quite a few um, events in the past, but what are the yeah. upcoming events that you're looking at gearing towards? So we've got two major ones upcoming, which is Unplugged and Battle of the Bands. Can you just give me a bit more detail about those two events, if possible? Uh, so yeah, Unplugged, it's going to be in the Holy Trinity Church in Street, which is just opposite the college, so it just, it's a hell of a lot easier. <laughs> Um, and the students will be supporting a main act, Amazing. which... <laughs> so you tell me a little bit more detail about the Battle of the Bands? Um, so yeah, it's being judged by Mike Levis and BBC Introducing, mm -hmm. and James from Muddy Rose Studio. Okay, okay. And then once they, so you've got the three bands from each college yes. coming towards uh, and doing the gig, and what's the prize? So around? first prize is a day at recording at Muddy Rose Studios and potentially being played on BBC Introducing. Yeah. Um, from your perspective, what's the best thing about doing an event planning and management unit? It's when it finally comes together and you can see the product being shown to everybody. It's quite nice. I mean, you've been through that process a few times. Do you yeah. remember back to the first time you did an event and how that felt compared to now? And maybe describe the differences between those experiences. Um, the first event was the Christmas concert. That was quite a stressful time. but. Now, obviously, you've got more experience. It's more marauding, and it's a lot more easier. <laughs> so, what are the skills you think that you've developed since maybe the start of the year, which is making it less stressful, easier, more confident, so stuff? Yeah, it's um, trying to get everybody involved and making sure they're focused, which isn't an easy task most of the time. <laughs> what is your favourite unit on the course? Oh, songwriting. <laughs> oh, sorry Michael, <laughs> but it's going to have to be Dan. <laughs> that's, that's the correct answer. Um, okay, so why do you love songwriting? Um, you can kind of just lose yourself in it and it's just quite a good way to release stuff and or realise something. It's just rewarding again. A lot of music is. And that's the one thing about the Battle of the Bands as well, it's all original material. Yes, right? yeah. So there's no covers at all. Yeah. What do you think that promotes? It promotes the young talent which we have at Strode and Richard Huish. And it gives them a chance to perform at Strode Theatre, which is a big, big venue. What's the capacity roughly? It's 300 uh, people take. But the stage is huge as well, and it gives them a lot of experience to go on. And so they've actually played a theatre. What are you hoping to do in the future? Do you hope this course gets you to um, I'd love to just work in a studio um, and just do session work, maybe do the odd gig or tour. But yeah, that's pretty much it. <laughs>